Good morning everyone, welcome back to another video. So today we are having a big shuffle about with the heft calves. The group that's behind me here, this is a pen of five. These have been weaned off the milk for a good couple of weeks now. So the calves are on milk for eight weeks in total. For the first five weeks they get fed twice a day and for the remaining three weeks they get fed once a day. And then after those eight weeks we then completely take them off milk and by that point they're eating a lot more hay and corn and so they don't need to be on milk. So once we take them off the milk and they're weaned we then put them into this pen behind us and then we keep on adding to that pen until it's a pen of five or six and then they stay in these wean pens for a couple of weeks and this is where they receive their pneumonia vaccination which is an intranasal vaccination which you have to give one dose and then two weeks later then you have to give the second dose once they've had their second dose they can then be moved up to the top shed which is our young stock shed we'll then add them to a pen of already six calves in there or it'll either be an empty pen and then another six will then join them so then that six will then become a 12 that 12 then will stay together move up the ranks so they'll remain in that group and remain friends for the rest of their lives so i consider this whole calf area to be like the nursery then where they're going up to next is going to be primary school and then and after they've completed all the years in primary school they then get moved up to another pen which is the maiden heifer or ai pen which i consider as high school and that's where they're at the age of being served so they're the horny heifers so once we've moved this group behind us up to the top shed we're then going to muck this pen out jet wash it disinfect it re-bed it again and then some of these calves have already been taken off milk they're already weaned off the milk but we haven't had the pen to put them in because these girls haven't completed the course of vaccinations yet so once these have moved and the pen's been cleaned out we can then wean some of these calves and then start making another pen of five the group behind me there they haven't completed their vaccinations yet but once they have they're going to join this group in the top shed and they will reunite and stay as that group of 12. right let's go and set the yard up and then we can get these girls moved let's come on let's go Okay, that's all the yards set up, ready to move the calves. This job can either go very well or very bad. Depends on how easily they wanna move. Some of them just wanna run away and run straight into the pen. Some of them are just really, really stubborn and they don't even wanna leave out the pen. So let's see how we get on with it. There we go. <laughs> Seems like they're taking us for a walk. Come on. Come on. Don't turn around now. Come on. seem to be happy with moving, change of scenery, more space in a bigger pen. So, and they're all skipping around, full of beans and energy. That's what we like to see, happy calves. So as I said earlier, we've just moved these five now and the next five to come up will be coming and joining this group in maybe a week or two. And then they'll stay as that group there and they'll move up through the ranks into each pen. They'll always stay with that group. And you can see behind me, this group here is already a group of 12, I think, on this one. 
so they all just stay together now and it helps with the whole social impact so I'm going to leave them to it now I'm going to go and strip the pen so my dad can come and muck it out in a minute and then it can be washed, cleaned, disinfected and rebedded for the next calves He's so happy, he's so happy Good boy You're a giant mate Clean the fronts out on these other ones while we're there. Pen's mocked out now, ready for jet washing. We always steam clean it so the temperature kills any bugs that may live and disinfect it, fresh bedding. We always, always, always put calves in a fresh pen. It's so important that we that they are kept super clean. At the end of the day, they're babies and they're so they're very prone to picking up viruses, diseases, bugs, or anything like that. So keep it nice and clean, eliminates any risk. Cool, let's crack on. And would you believe it? I've been off for my lunch, got my hair cut, come back, and the staff have completed the job. So, all the calves on the back row in the hutches, they've all been weaned now, although they were weaned, technically speaking, off their milk uh, a week ago. But we finally removed them from the hutch and put them into the weaned pen, what we call it. And they're all here together, a pen of six. Seem happy as Larry, nice clean pen. So that is what I like to call job well done. Also, while I have a minute, I am also just gonna say, I'm not going to be keeping up with the same frequency of videos because I feel like I'm putting extra pressure on myself to get the videos done every single week. So I don't want to be keeping up with the same frequency of the videos because I feel like the quality has been sort of deteriorating a little bit. So I want quality videos and not quantity videos coming out. So point being is I'm not going to be putting a video out every week. It might be every two weeks or every now and then, but we'll figure it out. I will be continuing with the videos, just not as often. So that brings me to the end of this video, guys. If you've enjoyed it, you know the drill. Hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate the support. Thank you very much for watching, and I shall see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Goodbye.